All right, so here I am in Dringy Layby, as I call it, or as everybody else calls it. And uh, it's a beautiful, sunny day, really hot. And uh, at home in Cornwall, I believe it uh, started off as a very, very horrible, very, very horrible, wet, miserable day. But I'm going to cook myself some lunch and we're going to have some enchiladas. So I'm just going to climb up. And uh, there's the old ridge monkey. This video comes to you by a ridge monkey. The people that make these wonderful machines, Ridge, ridge Monkey. And I'm just going to cook some s Mexican spicy chicken enchiladas. I have these at home sometimes. But, um, here's my old coffee maker. <laughs> um, what we have here is oven cook. 200 degrees, with a gas mark 6 for 15 minutes. Oh, didn't see that bit. And then remove the lid and cook for a further 15 minutes. Ooh, fish could be interesting. Typical lorry driver, only seen the first bit. <laughs> 15 minutes, yeah, that'll do. That should be right. Should be should be fine. All right, so I've bent the corners up a little bit. I've got the uh, Ridge Monkey uh, Connect combi set, which has got the extra compartments in, so you can do your other bits and pieces. But the instructions on the oven only cook says um, to keep the film lid on, but pierce it in many places and then cook for 15 minutes and then take that top tray out. So I'm going to give this a bit of a gamble and I'm going to do exactly what it says. I've bent the, um, the top round just a little bit so that the lid closes and I'm just going to use it as an oven straight off. And then um, after 15 minutes you uh, take the uh, top off and cook for a further 15 minutes. So I'm just going to use the Ridge Monkey purely as an oven, and we'll see how it goes. There, I put um, a timer on my on my phone, so we can uh, get the grips with this chicken enchiladas, eh? Looking forward to that. Look at that beautiful, beautiful day. It is a beautiful, beautiful day. There's a rook <laughs> just there walking down the middle of the road here. That's about as much excitement as <laughs> we were getting at the moment, I tell you. But uh, as you can see, it is gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous. There's a nice old Ford tractor in there. Still gets used. Uh, there's a runway up there. That trailer's in the way. Yeah, right, right where that trailer is in the field is a uh, a grass runway, farm runway. And um, he was there plowing the or cutting the grass on the runway, so it's nice and smooth. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. What a day! The enchiladas are doing well. Let me VIP a peg. <laughs> oh dear. I'll tell you what we'll do. We will have a look. Mm. Seems to be doing fine. Now, I normally say cook on a low, low, low heat. Uh, as you can see by the dial, I am actually on minimum but it's higher than normal I normally have it so there's just about a flame but there's a, a lot more of a flame at the moment because the uh, recipe 
the instructions do say 200 degrees. Yeah, 200 degrees. Guess what? Six. So that's that's hot, you know. So I thought I would do just that. Have it a lot hotter than normal. And uh, according to the time, uh, how are we doing? Three minutes of 33 left of my first 15 minutes, so ideal. Right, I can really smell that's cooking now. 15 minutes is up, so I've removed the, uh, the lid on the top. And I'm going to slide it back into its position. Close the lid. Reset back for 15 minutes and start. There we go. In the meantime, I'm going to enjoy my drink and the sun. Just keep an eye on what's going on. There's a funny man going up and down doing some exercises. Uh, <laughs> he's walking up and down. I think that's his lorry up there. And he seems to be walking up and down and uh, waving his arms about and stuff. Be quite amusing. In the meantime, I'm still cooking my tea. Matey doing the walking and the exercises is actually coming back down again. What if he's going to wave his arms around today? Or this time, rather. Soon find out. Trouble is, in Dringy Levi here, there isn't so much to do. You know, it's... Uh, Walking up and down the lay is about the only thing, any exercise you can do. I have seen somebody walk into the field before. Nah. Anyway, got ten minutes left. I can smell that. It smells handsome. It's just smelling good. In fact, I just lifted a lid and you can see all the, uh, all the stuff all bubbling away quite happily. So it's just... That's what it looks like behind me. It's wall to wall. I think there's one Englishman uh, in, in this lot, apart from me, and that's him who just turned up in front. Here we go, we got... Uh, Three and a half minutes to go, and it's all cooking very, very well. It smells handsome. So that's a proper oven, using the Ridge Monkey as an oven, the old Ridge Monkey, Monkey Connect Combo, Combi. Looking good. It really is bubbling away in there. I would say that was cooked, but um, just, just going to wait for the extra couple of minutes, and then uh, we'll be done. Woohoo! We are cooked. Look at it all bubbling away in there. Who knew you can use one of these Connect combis for uh, actually as a straight oven? I put the dish in it and all that. And as you can see by the size of the, uh, oh, they're cooking and banging. It's in the exact fit. I just had to bend in that little bit at the end just to make it so you would shut completely. And we're done. I'm gonna dish this up now. Well, I broke it all getting it out of the uh, the tub. But on the whole. I'm going to really tuck in now and enjoy this. Well, thank you for Ridge Monkey for supplying the uh, Connect Combi. It's done a wonderful job of acting as an oven. And uh, that meal cooked right through. It's steaming hot. Absolutely wonderful. And uh, I can honestly say I've never had one of these in the uh, lorry before. So I will catch up with you later. Thank you for watching and I will endeavour to enjoy this.
See you later.